Imidazole is an organic compound with the formula C3N2H4. It is a white or colorless solid that is soluble in water, producing a mildly alkaline solution. In chemistry, it is an aromatic heterocycle, classified as a diazole, and has non-adjacent nitrogen atoms. Many natural products, especially alkaloids, contain the imidazole ring. These imidazoles share the 1,3C3N2 ring but feature varied substituents. This ring system is present in important biological building blocks, such as histidine and the related hormone histamine. Many drugs contain an imidazole ring, such as certain antifungal drugs, the nitroimidazole series of antibiotics, and the sedative midazolam. When fused to a pyrimidine ring, it forms purine, which is the most widely occurring nitrogen containing heterocycle in nature. The name imidazole was coined in 1887 by the German chemist Arthur Rudolf Hantz (1857–1935). Structure and properties. Imidazole is a planar five-membered ring. It exists in two equivalent tautomeric forms, because hydrogen can be bound to one or the other nitrogen atom. Imidazole is a highly polar compound, as evidenced by its electric dipole moment of 3.67 d it is highly soluble in water. The compound is classified as aromatic due to the presence of a planar ring containing six pi electrons, a pair of electrons from the protonated nitrogen atom and one from each of the remaining four atoms of the ring. Some resonance structures of imidazole are shown below. Amphoterism Imidazole is amphoteric. That is, it can function as both an acid and as a base. As an acid, the pKa of imidazole is 14.5, making it less acidic than carboxylic acids, phenols, and imides, but slightly more acidic than alcohols. The acidic proton is the one bound to nitrogen. Deprotonation gives the imidazole anion, which is symmetrical. As a base, the pKa of the conjugate acid, cited as pKbH+, to avoid confusion between the two, is approximately 7, making imidazole approximately 60 times more basic than pyridine. The basic site is the nitrogen with the lone pair, and not bound to hydrogen. Protonation gives the imidazoleum cation, which is symmetrical. Preparation Imidazole was first reported in 1858 by the German-British chemist Heinrich Debus, although various imidazole derivatives had been discovered as early as the 1840s. It was shown that glyoxyl, formaldehyde, and ammonia condensed to form imidazole, glyoxaline, as it was originally named. This synthesis, while producing relatively low yields, is still used for generating C-substituted imidazoles. In one microwave modification, the reactants are benzyl, benzaldehyde and ammonia in glacial acetic acid, forming 2,4,5-triphenylimidazole. Lofine. Imidazole can be synthesized by numerous methods besides the Debus method. Many of these syntheses can also be applied to substituted imidazoles by varying the functional groups on the reactants. These methods are commonly categorized by the number of reacting components. One component the 1, 5, or 3, 4 bond can be formed by the reaction of an imidate and an alpha aminoaldehyde or alpha aminoacetyl. The example below applies to imidazole when R1. R2 Hydrogen Two component the 1, 2, and 2, 3 bonds can be formed by treating a 1, 2 diaminoalkane, at high temperatures, with an alcohol, aldehyde, or carboxylic acid. A dehydrogenating catalyst, such as platinum on alumina, is required. The 1, 2, and 3, 4 bonds can also be formed from N substituted alpha aminoketones and formamide with heat. The product will be a 1, 4 di substituted imidazole, but here since R1. R2 Hydrogen, imidazole itself is the product. The yield of this reaction is moderate, but it seems to be the most effective method of making the 1,4 substitution. 3 component This method proceeds in good yields for substituted imidazoles. An adaptation of the Debus method, it is called the debus radzichewski imidazole synthesis. The starting materials are substituted glyoxyl, aldehyde, amine, and ammonia or an ammonium salt. 
formation from other heterocyclosimidazole can be synthesized by the photolysis of one vinyl tetrazole. This reaction will give substantial yields only if the one vinyl tetrazole is made efficiently from an organodin compound, such as 2 tributylstanol tetrazole. The reaction, shown below, produces imidazole when R1. R2 R3 equals hydrogen. Imidazole can also be formed in a vapor phase reaction. The reaction occurs with formamide, ethylene diamine, and hydrogen over platinum on alumina, and it must take place between 340 and 480 degrees Celsius. This forms a very pure imidazole product. Van Leusen reaction The Van Leusen reaction can also be employed to form imidazoles starting from tosmic and an aldamine. The Van Leusen imidazole synthesis allows the preparation of imidazoles from aldamines by reaction with tosylmethyl isocyanide tosmic. The reaction has later been expanded to a two-step synthesis in which the aldamine is generated in situ. The Van Leusen three-component reaction VL3CR. Biological significance and applications. Imidazole is incorporated into many important biological molecules. The most pervasive is the amino acid histidine, which has an imidazole side chain. Histidine is present in many proteins and enzymes and plays a vital part in the structure and binding functions of hemoglobin. Imidazole-based histidine compounds play a very important role in intracellular buffering. Histidine can be decarboxylated to histamine, which is also a common biological compound. Histamine can cause urticaria hives, when it is produced during allergic reaction. The relationship between histidine and histamine is shown below. One of the applications of imidazole is in the purification of his tagged proteins in immobilized metal affinity chromatography IMAC. Imidazole is used to elute tagged proteins bound to nickel ions attached to the surface of beads in the chromatography column. An excess of imidazole is passed through the column, which displaces the histag from nickel coordination, freeing the histag proteins. Imidazole has become an important part of many pharmaceuticals. Synthetic imidazoles are present in many fungicides and antifungal, antiprotozole, and antihypertensive medications. Imidazole is part of the theophylline molecule, found in tea leaves and coffee beans, that stimulates the central nervous system. It is present in the anti-cancer medication mercaptopurine, which combats leukemia by interfering with DNA activities. A number of substituted imidazoles, including clotrimazole, are selective inhibitors of nitric oxide synthase, which makes them interesting drug targets in inflammation, neurodegenerative diseases and tumors of the nervous system. Other biological activities of the imidazole pharmacophore relate to the downregulation of intracellular Ca2 plus and K plus fluxes, and interference with translation initiation. Pharmaceutical derivatives The substituted imidazole derivatives are valuable in treatment of many systemic fungal infections. Imidazoles belong to the class of azole antifungals, which includes ketoconazole, myconazole, and clotrimazole. For comparison, another group of azoles is the triazoles, which includes fluconazole, itraconazole, and boriconazole. The difference between the imidazoles and the triazoles involves the mechanism of inhibition of the cytochrome P450 enzyme. The N3 of the imidazole compound binds to the heme iron atom of ferric cytochrome P450, whereas the N4 of the triazoles bind to the heme group. The triazoles have been shown to have a higher specificity for the cytochrome P450 than imidazoles, thereby making them more potent than the imidazoles. Some imidazole derivatives show effects on insects, for example sulconazole nitrate exhibits a strong anti-feeding effect on the keratin-digesting Australian carpet beetle larva Anthronoceros australis, as does econazole nitrate with the common clothes moth Tineola bisseliella. Industrial applications Imidazole has been used extensively as a corrosion inhibitor on certain transition metals, such as copper. Preventing copper corrosion is important, especially in aqueous systems, where the conductivity of the copper decreases due to corrosion. Imidazoles can also be used as organic structure directing agents to synthesize zeolites. 
Many compounds of industrial and technological importance contain imidazole derivatives. The thermostable polybenzimidazole PBI contains imidazole fused to a benzene ring and linked to a benzene, and acts as a fire retardant. Imidazole can also be found in various compounds that are used for photography and electronics. Salts of imidazole Salts of imidazole where the imidazole ring is in the cation are known as imidazoleum salts, for example, imidazoleum chloride. These salts are formed from the protonation or substitution at nitrogen of imidazole. These salts have been used as ionic liquids and precursors to stable carbons. Salts where a deprotonated imidazole is an anion are also well known. These salts are known as imidazolates for example, sodium imidazolate, NaC3H3N2. Related heterocycles Benzimidazole, an analog with a fused benzene ring Dihydroimidazole or imidazoline, an analog where 4,5 double bond is saturated Pyrrole, an analog with only one nitrogen atom in position 1 Oxazole, an analog with the nitrogen atom in position 1 replaced by oxygen Thiazole, an analog with the nitrogen atom in position 1 replaced by sulfur Pyrazole, an analog with two adjacent nitrogen atoms Triazoles, analogs with three nitrogen atoms See also 1-methylamidazole 4-methylamidazole References, <references>